spell. Hey guys, so I'm here in Quito, Ecuador, and we are on our first adventure. Um, <laughs> so we drove out from the city about an hour and a half to Cotopaxi Volcano. going to be mountain biking down this volcano. So you can kind of see it behind me. It's up in the clouds, it's covered in snow. It's really pretty, so it should be really fun. I'm really excited. I'm all bundled up because even though we're at the equator, which is normally really hot, it's like a really high altitude. So it's hard to breathe. So it's tough to breathe, I'm a little dizzy. This altitude is a real thing and it, it really does affect you. So we have coca leaves, we have some coca candy to kind of help us feel better and to drink lots of water. We also had the option to hike up this part of the mountain and there's like a little chalet up there. It's kind of hard to see, but as soon as I started hiking, I got really winded, I got really dizzy, and so I ultimately decided that it just wasn't something I could do. And so I'm just hanging out on the bus with a couple of other girls and just chilling out and getting ready to do this mountain biking. <laughs> So I just got the drone up in the air for a little bit to try to capture the mountain. Unfortunately, a big cloud rolled in right when I did that. So you can kind of see this, like, I'm it's all white behind me. That is a big, big cloud. But then down here, that's the trail we're gonna be biking down. And we are unloading our bikes right now and we're gonna start riding pretty soon. You see the bikes right up there. for our helmets. I have a really small head so I have my beanie on and my helmet and this thing is still a little wobbly but I should be okay. <laughs> Got to do gloves and then get on our bikes and get going. So here we go. We're all ready. They're all bundled. We're gonna start riding. I'll see you guys at the bottom. First part and it was so scary. I thought I was gonna fall the whole time. So yeah, this is this is really intense, but it's really beautiful, fun so far, but very scary.
No one got it on film. But it was great. The bike fell under me and I kind of just did a weird little dance and then jumped up and it was fine. Kind of like when I fell when I did sandboarding in Brazil. Similar to that. So I'm fine. I'm not hurt. Don't worry mom and dad. We're halfway down right now. The peak is up behind me. It's so beautiful here. Coming in hot. <laughs> we got the rest of us coming up right now and then we're going to make our way to, to finish it off. All the boys over here. It's a kind of like a back way down like the side of the mountain. It's a little more chaotic. Um, I'm sticking to the road, which is a little safer. Still crazy, clearly, because I fell. <laughs> Any comments? Bring on more. Bring on more. Bring on more. <laughs> again next oh, weekend. <laughs> How about tomorrow? Let's do it again. Let's do it right now. Uh, <laughs> I can do it again. I'm, I'm totally down to go again. I need my bike. Y'all crazy. <laughs> If you like these sort of adventure blogs, go ahead and click right here and check out my safari of Chobe National Park in Botswana. Guys, we found lions. 